Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo, and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank Up Your Arsenal. Uh, from the, it's been like literally two seconds since I recorded the last uh, video. I'm doing these in bulk, so we literally haven't gone anywhere. I just finished the amoeboid battle, or whatever that thing was. That thing was weird. Um, the ranger base on Cow, 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 Island is under ferocious assault by the Tyranoids. Repulse the enemy attack, then lead the raid to capture a hover ship launch pad at the center of the island. Or I could just return to my ship. But, I'm gonna do this. That music is bumping. You can't lie, Ratchet and Clank music is just the best. I can't remember. Does this one put us in the city? I think there's one that puts us in the city. Ooh. Okay. Oh, no. I'm sorry, soldier. Ooh, okay. Watch that one. I got... I took, like, two or three hits the last time I did the jump mission. So this time I'm trying not to take any hits. Ooh. That one should have got me. That one, that one was right on tar uh, right on target. Okay, okay. Um, by the way, this is also the first Ratchet and Clank, uh, the first Ratchet and Clank game that ever included multiplayer. So yeah, I had a lot of fun with that back in the day. Woo! Nice, got it. Whoa! Thought the game crashed. Hello, hello. Are we are we still are we good? Is everybody are you okay? Is everybody okay? Still says I'm recording. That's important. Okay. Dang, I never thought I'd have to turn the music down, but I might actually want to turn it down for this one. Ah, it's it's 20 years old. They won't, they won't sue me, but they'll probably give the ad revenue to whatever company owns the game now. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> I'd, I'd, I'd honestly... The noise are over the <laughs> the ah! Hey! Oh well, I guess I boosted too hard. Oh, okay. Coming right up over the bridge, eh? Roger that. Yeah, I don't have to drop the music down because, along with all the firing and blasting, you know, it, it doesn't it doesn't really mess with anything. That new armor is really helping me out, and I'm gonna keep using my mini turret glove because I love to see it upgrade. It just hit V2. That's right. That's right. I just duh. We just watched that. I, I should have been like, yay, V2. Oh, dang. We lost one of our boys. I didn't realize that was a giant missile turret right there. Whoop! Dang! Blast it? I tried to jump that blast. What the? What hit me that time? Okay, technically, since that's V2, I should probably switch back to the, um. Roger that! Oh! Nice. Can my time to find out? No, oh, blast it! They got me. Nope. There's oh. I'm going for that health. Dang. No! Stop it!
Oh no! <laughs> oh man! You heard it, the classic click, 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 empty. <laughs> Got one for you. Ah, oh, blast it. I think that's in the wrong spot. I need. There we go. Need to aim. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Getting that good aim. I think I lost all the little soldier guys. Uh, oh. Dang, he could still hit me. I threw two by accident. Because I got hit. Ooh. We're doing great, I think. I want... No, oh man, that's right, I can't... Oh, I can get to the lava gun, I just have to use the the D-pad for it, and not the um, analog stick. For some reason, the analog stick is kind of buggy on that top left corner. Oh well. Whoa, no, the thing, it's firing the things at me. And those deal a lot of damage. Dang. I gotta take out those missile guns. This guy. That's not gonna reach. Those are the things I'm really worried about. No! Why can't I? Can I just jump them? No! Jump! Oh man, you really gotta... Nope. I think it literally intersected it. Is there like a sniper? There is a sniper rifle in this game. I'm sure there is. Wait, don't don't take them out. Maybe they'll go take the turrets out for me. Nope, they'll just take out each other. Bro, I am about done. Um, shoot. I don't see any other nanotech. Just a little bit of ammo. Uh, the one thing that might have range would be... Wait, there's nanotech. The one thing that might have range might be the Glove of Doom minions, but I'm all out of those. And I swear to God, I hear thunder again. That makes me... That, that brings me the great sad. I don't think I have anything to get the range on those turrets. But we're gonna try. This is the thing I have with the longest range, I think. Let's give it a shot. Jump! Jump! Oh, you can jump them! But they're impossible! Ah, oh, no! You can't do this to me! I could just get under that one. Oh, God. See? Ah, do not fire at me. Do not fire at me. Do not fire at me. Got him. I'm just going to ignore him. Oh, wait. No, I can't. I actually have to take him out. Refractor! I probably shouldn't have done that. It'd be nice if I could have this open the entire time while fighting them. Like, if I could just equip it and it would stay equipped. Instead of me having to hold it. Because then I would have it out all the time, but... That was kind of like, uh... I think there was a weapon like that on Going Commando. Uh-oh. No. Uh, I thought there was another platform. Alright, folks, we're back where I left off uh, the last time, as far as I made it before. Uh, I'm trying to use my enemies to take out the last two turrets, but it looks like the... Um... There we go. Yeah, see, it's working. The Infector leveled up, by the way. Yes, he's doing great! That, that's a perfect... Like, that's a perfect utilization for that. Hmm. With one left, I think we can leave it to our Agents of Doom. Oh, there we go. I just gotta be careful, because... Yep, if I get close enough... Dang. Get him, boys. 
Thank goodness. Okay. Much better. Okay, next mission. Uh, dog fight over. I'm gonna call it Crow. Apply the hover ship. Use the left analog stick. Press X or L1 to ascend. Square or L2 to descend. Use the right analog stick to aim. And press circle or R1 to fire rockets. I'll take care of the saucer, Sarge. Keep blasting those dropships. Alright. Gonna try not to hit my dudes. All I see is uh, the saucers, but there's the blaster. Wait, I don't see missiles. I don't think I have any right now. Unless these are my missiles. I thought they were just my regular things. Oh, hold up. Hold up. Drop ship. Yeah, we're getting them. Can I get nanotech from here? Yes. Did it work? Watch those drop ships. Nice. Just this one's a really good one for using the mini map to find out where everything is. I actually take a fair bit of damage from these dudes. These saucers should back off once you take out the last of the drop ships. Last of the drop ships, that would be this guy probably. Nope. Dude behind him? Oh, we're getting there. Nice. Dang, nope, that doesn't count towards my ship's uh, durability. Oh well. Uh oh. We don't want him close to us. Dang, it's like I've never led the target before. Jeez. I'm doing a better job than the dropship, though. There we go. Nice. Next. Part 3, Operation Thunderbolt. The Tyranoid base is protected by an impenetrable force field. We're still trying to figure out a way to get past it. In the meantime, Command wants you to take the hover ship and wipe out the Noid forces in the surrounding areas. Roger that. Something's back here, but no, that's... Oh, wait. Dropship. Okay. Watch it. Um, one of those... Um... Yeah, one of those turret things has my... It's, it's got my number. There we go. Where is it, actually? Dang. Ah, bless it. It's that one, isn't it? Up on top of the hill? Yep. There it is. Ooh, always keep moving. Dang, why didn't it... Ah, I thought I intersected it. I intercepted it. This is not going well. Watch it. There's another one. Oh, one's coming for me. Can I outrun those missiles? There we go. So they do have a range. we got to get close enough for this thing to deploy, but not so close that I can't avoid its attacks. Oh, boy. There we go. There's a little bit of auto-targeting on there. Maybe. Not sure. Oh no! Oh god, there's two of them. Okay, so you can hit them, but it's a little bit difficult. There was one over here to the left. I'm trying to take out that one. Dang, I can't even see it. Come on now. Take a hit. There we go. Sorry I have to keep firing this thing, but it's the only way to get hits. I might come really close to going down on this one, so... A guy... Ah! I'm gonna have to... Yeah, there we go. Anybody have any idea how we're supposed to shut down this force field? Uh, H-26, 
Why don't you try sticking your finger in the main power transformer? Are you sure that's a good idea, sir? This thing looks pretty dangerous. I'm trying to avoid that missile. I think it might be done now, though. Oh god, there's another one. I didn't even see it. <laughs> you just gotta keep moving. Uh oh, that one might have got me. I'm not sure. <laughs> uh, H-26 has been vaporized, sir. Oh, dear. But the force field has been deactivated. All right. Now Trooper deserves a medal. Complete your mission and report back to base for briefing. Nice. I was about to say, it doesn't look deactivated to me. Uh, final battle. There we go. Final battle. Let's do it. Anoids are just about finished. Trust me, Sarge. This one's going to be a cakewalk. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. I got an idea. Infector V2. Might as well wait till my turret's done. I will use the enemy to defeat the enemy. Whoa! I don't think that's very useful. Oh, there we go. Pardon me. Oh, that's cool. That makes a good ally. Yeah, just refractor. Nice. It's useful every now and again. That'll never get him, will it? Can it bounce that high? No. It did! It did get him! <laughs> I use a lot of the non-conventional weapons that most people in the playthroughs don't use, I guess. Ooh! Like, uh, most people probably just stick to the blaster. Keep your eyes peeled. The noise might be waiting for us at the next bridge. Ooh, a little bit of lag there. One left. Let's just see what it do. Nice. Oh, good hit. Uh, mega turret. No, it's the mini turret, right. Ammo! The game's been kind of laggy a little bit right now, so I hope that doesn't mess up the stream. Well, it's not streaming, it's a recording, so... I think it'll be alright. Okay, so the main shield is down. Got him. <laughs> that was pretty cool, you gotta admit. Ooh! Oh, good hits. Whoa! Okay, we're definitely gonna wanna take some of that out before we go forward. Hang on, fellas, I'm getting some ammo, or some H, uh, some health. But that's all, folks. Alright. As long as we made some progress, it's fine. Uh, Agents of Doom! Oh, I hate to waste them on the little guys. What's left to take out? That other turret? But it's still shielded, isn't it? Hmm. I say we move forward a little bit. Find out what's really going on. Woo. Oh, okay. It's not shielded. Can my Agents of Doom reach it? Go get them, fellas! Oh god, they can't. Yep. 
take this thing out. There we go. I don't know what took it out the first time. The other one was easy. Oh gosh. I think those guys took the first one out. Now how am I supposed to get up there and get this dude? Oh, refractor? Hang on. Excuse me, sir? Could you please? Nice. Kabu. Okay. That's awesome. I love it. Uh, and return to your ship. That's awesome. That is cool. I love it. Um, I probably didn't have to use the uh, refractor to take out that last guy, but it was difficult to find anything with the range and that angle, you know? Like, looking almost straight up with any weapon in this game is kind of annoying. Not gonna lie. I mean, it might not be so bad with enemies, like, if they weren't firing at you, but, like, let's say you got, like, the blaster. And it's like, you're moving around, now you gotta press this button, and then angle up. See how slow that is? I mean, you could probably make it faster, but really, do you want to go through all that? It, this, you know, this game's been out a while. Don't be, don't, don't split hairs, you know? Uh, oh! That's what I should have had. That would have been perfect for taking away those far away, taking out those far away targets. I could have took out those, uh, I could have took out those missile launcher, um, I could have, I could have taken out those missile launchers, no problem. But, I wanted to call them mortar launchers, because it was kind of like, you know, they go up at an angle, and then they come back down. So they're more like mortars, but yeah, I just didn't have the right weapon. Ejects portable shields that can be used as cover or block enemies. The hollow shields can only absorb a certain amount of damage before they degenerate. Oh. Hey, I should have had that too. It's an excellent weapon for sniping. To enter sniper mode, equip the flux rifle and press L1. Use R1 and R2 to zoom your view in and out. Uh oh. The flux rifle is an excellent oh, weapon it. for sniping. It's not going to keep to doing it, is it? enter sniper mode, equip the flux rifle and press L1. Use R1 and R2 to zoom your view in and out. Oh, thank God. I thought it was going to keep doing that again and again and again. I knew there was a sniper rifle you could zoom in and out. Remember I was trying to zoom in and out uh, from the one on Ratchet and Clank Going Commando? Ages ago? I knew there was a sniper rifle you could zoom in and out. Man, I'm good. <laughs> I might not remember people's names, but I remember stuff about my video mo Vigimo games. <laughs> where's where's one of these ships? How do you fire? Oh, probably circle, duh. Wait. Come on. Yeah. No, come here. Jesus. I'm that bad at this. Got him. I'm just wasting ammo. <laughs> yep. Oh god, it is gonna keep doing it. Stop! No! I'm gonna turn help I'm gonna turn help desk uh, desk messages off if you don't stop. You better go away. Wait, no. Back. I just wanted to buy ammo. Actually I can do that on the Phoenix. Let's go back to the Phoenix. That's um, another thing that I enjoyed about this game is like they made it so that the Starship Phoenix is kind of like your home base. I always wind up going back there in between missions. It's just a thing. It was the biggest Tyranoid you've ever seen. <laughs> Big as a Star Cruiser and packing twice as much firepower. There was no escape. He was coming right at me. Closer, closer. Oh, what am I gonna do, right? Closer, even closer. Click, click. My blaster jam. <laughs> no way. What happened next? Yes, go on. We're all riveted. So, this is the mighty Q force I've heard so much about. Pathetic. I could obliterate the lot of you, and they wouldn't even mention it in Supervillain Weekly. True, sir, but you'd have done the fashion world an enormous service. Oh. And as for you, Agent Clank, 
I have far grander plans for you. <laughs> All right, Lawrence, you can turn it off now. Oh, may I, sir? What a treat. <laughs> Al, come in! Yellow! Someone just transmitted a hologram onto the ship. I need to know where the signal came from. Let's see. Back tracing the signal. Hmm. Six path alpha key encryption. Amateurs. I got it. It came from a facility on planet Dax. Their computer files. Planet Dax. Aha! I found something suspicious. Hatching it through now. Tonight, we take a journey inside the enigmatic mind of our galaxy. Super villain weekly, I guess. Genius, Dr. Nefarious. We'll take a tour of this secret facility on planet Dax. I remember that. some of the galaxy's most insidious super weapons, including the dreaded rainbow Afrolyzer. Dr. Nefarious, we've all enjoyed your past work, but how do you respond to critics who say your latest galactic schemes are just more of the same? I will annihilate them! Lawrence, tell us a bit about this top secret super weapon being constructed on planet Dax. I remember that one. Well, super is such a strong word. For that matter, weapon may be a tad overdoing it. <laughs> we do, however, have a lovely view of the ocean at sunset. Is Dr. Nefarious poised on the brink of galactic domination? Or is this super weapon just the latest in a series of maniacal pipe dreams? Stay tuned for more from Supervillain Weekly. Whatever Nefarious is doing on Dax, it can't be good. We'll check it out. You're welcome. Dang, I was gonna say this game is a lot longer than I thought. I'm gonna have to switch to like daily uploads to finish it because uh, I I still want to do um, Deadlocked, and I've got more characters on War of Shinobi to do. But I'm having a lot of fun, so that's what it's mostly about. Hey, as long as, and and I hope you're having fun too. But um, all right. But anyway, that's all the time I have left for this episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, let me know in the comment section below. Likes are always appreciated. And until next time, take it easy, my friends.